my, my day job is I'm a lawyer. I'm a practicing criminal defense lawyer. About 10 years ago, I took up plein air painting. I was a prosecutor first, then I became a defense lawyer, and I've been doing it for about 30 years. You know, I kind of practice law by day and slip in painting when I can. And then about eight years ago, I was really sick. Um, I had pancreatic cancer and um, decided, you know, I'm going to do something else for a little while. I, and I, I can't really say that, you know, the cancer thing was the impetus because I had started painting um, before I was diagnosed with cancer. And it, it wasn't like this great epiphany, you know, like, you know, stop and smell the flowers. But it really took the drive to practice law 14 hours a day it was just gone at that point. These things, they all ebb and flow, right? Sometimes for short periods of time, sometimes for very long periods of time, I'm intensely focused on what I'm doing in the practice of law. But, you know, it's sometimes the tide's out and then my art picks up. I try to do something art related every day. Sometimes I don't make it. Um, sometimes if I'm not feeling well and there are times when I still don't feel well, then I won't do art for two weeks at a time. Sky is a huge part of plein air painting. Light changing. It, and it changes not just in, in light because on a sunny day I have maybe two hours to complete a painting. But you know, you get out and you notice things like the, the color changes in the bark and the color changes in the buds. You know, people will stop by when you're painting outdoors and they'll say, this must be so relaxing. And it's relaxing in the way that taking a beating is relaxing. Um, it's hard work. Um, and if you're not focused, then you're um, playing. And not playing in a constructive way, you're, you're goofing around. It's not nearly as rewarding as when you're in the moment. Painting is, to me, a huge part of mining memories, is getting, or not getting in touch, but staying in touch with lives past, with memories past, with family and friends and places. Um, I love painting um, the places I grew up. You know, I love painting, painting the Midwest. I love painting Ohio and Columbus. You know, it's, it's finding a connection and, and nursing that connection that painting is to me, I think.